Hi guys, my name is Baruch. I'm a professional designer and today we're going to be designing a thumbnail in Pic Studio. Before we get started, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Let's go! First, start by getting an idea of what's been done before. You can do that by searching the title of your new video in the YouTube search bar and seeing what other creators have done, just to get an idea what's out there. You can also use platforms like Instagram and Pinterest for your mood board and start compiling inspiration for what your thumbnails could look like. Okay everyone, click create a design. Let's press YouTube thumbnail. Now, let's add a background. To add a background, click on change color. I'm gonna go for green. Let's add a picture. Now I've already uploaded this picture, so we're gonna click on it and select it. Let's add a frame. To add a frame, you go to adjust and click on frame. Try to find a frame that matches this thumbnail. So I'm going with something more organic. So I'm gonna go with this shape. Now I'm gonna drag it to the bottom left and I'm gonna enlarge it. Perfect. Let's add some elements. Now I'm gonna go to the lines and click on see all. Now let's scroll down. I'm gonna click on this one. I selected this one because it looks like land formations as I'm going for a travel vlog kind of thumbnail. I'm gonna adjust the color. I'm gonna select this color. Now I'm gonna move it to the top left and have it behind this picture. Perfect. I'm gonna select another element. Enlarge it. Place it on the top right, change color. Place it behind the picture. The last thing to add to this thumbnail, text. I'm gonna click on add a heading. Now I'm gonna drag it to the top right. Now let's enlarge this text. Now, let's change the line spacing. Now for this text, I want to change the color. And let's select a color that complements this thumbnail. Let's add one final element. I'm gonna select this and I'm gonna place it in between the headline. Now I'm gonna change the color. Now let's export it. We're gonna name this design thumbnail and press download and press download again. And here we have it. Thank you for watching and let me know what you want me to design next. See you soon and stay creative.